Hi everybody and welcome to the Dining Hall Celebration Assembly. It's great to be doing this recording, although it's very strange doing it from my house. Um, but I know your teachers have been busy talking with you and speaking with your parents and receiving emails about who really has been using their gem powers this week, which is fabulous. So let's get started. So who's our first class going to be? Let's see. Da -da 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 -da. It's Pegasus class. And Miss Turner has selected Obeyed. Oh, Get to the What have you been up to, Obeyed? Well, you've used your sapphire power this week, been really focused on your learning, and I can see that you've made a fabulous map with lots of symbols on, and so you've really been using your geographical skills, which is fabulous. I think it was about making your house into a jungle and the route you would have to take, which is following on from Mr. Barker's video. Fabulous, well done. Now to our next class, and the next class is down in reception. So that's Sun class. Hi, Sun class, hope you're doing okay. And from Sun class, your teacher, Miss Preston, has picked two actually. She's picked Ashton and Thea. <laughs> Now then, what have you two been up to? Well, Ashton and Thea, you have both been using your emerald power this week and you have learned some fantastic number facts, Ashton. And for Thea, you've used your emerald power to produce a really great piece of writing about what it's like being you as a superhero. Wow, that sounds great. Well done. Let's see who's next. It's Mars class, so in year one. And from year one, Miss Hanley has selected Georgia. So, Georgia, what are you up Well, Georgia, you have also been using your emerald power. Now, Miss Hanley spoke with your mum and she said that you'd been finding it a little bit tricky and running out of steam when you were doing your home learning, which we know is really tricky at the moment. So, after having a chat with Miss Hanley and talking about your gem powers, which you've got even at home, not just while you're at school, that's what we can use them everywhere. And you have used your emerald power and you have supercharged your learning. And this is a great picture of you cracking on doing your work. So well done to you. That is great news. And now up to the top of school, to year six and comic class. And from comic class, it is Lucas. Oh, now, Lucas, looks like you're having a great time. Fortunately, you've got your mum as an amazing cook at home and it looks like you've made some jam tarts which have given you the energy to really focus on your maths learning and you've produced some fabulous work. So well done, keep up the good work, but don't eat too many of those jam tarts. Okay, and to the next class. The next class is Aquila. 
so, Aquila. Mr. Barker, who's been producing some rather funny videos and making me giggle. And from Aquila class, um, Mr. Barker selected Ethan. Well done, Ethan. I hope you're dancing in your house. Now, Ethan, you've been working really hard this week creating your map of your reimagined jungle in your home. So you've had to use a compass, you've orientated your map, you've researched symbols, and to do all of that, you've produced a really factually accurate map. And you've used your sapphire power. Absolutely great. It's been a lot of work, but with great results. Well done you. And now to our next class. Our next class is... Titan class and Titan class. Mr. Burns has selected Ollie. Oh, well done, Ollie. Now, this was a, is a really, really lovely one and seeing some ruby power. And we need to be showing a lot of ruby power at the moment with everything going on. But Ollie, you've used your ruby power and you have created some fantastic things for people to see as they pass you by, pass your house by. So we've got a clap for carers, thanking all the carers for all their hard work with the people they're looking after some great lovely rainbows to cheer people up when they walk past them and also a really exciting hopscotch for your postman or post lady must be having a great time coming to your house i wonder if any of your post people have dressed up as people round by me i've got a spider man who delivers my mail which is all very bizarre but i love it every morning when i see him arriving with his mail he does make me giggle lots of ruby power well done ollie fantastic and now to our next class which is serious class i believe oh it is managed to get that one right in the right order i know i sometimes get confused and from Sirius class, the award from Miss Hennessy is going to Sophie. Get rocking, Sophie. Now, Sophie, you've got an Emerald Award. You've been completing all of your learning every day. Sometimes you've had a little bit of problems with the technology and communication, but you've kept going and you've kept motivated. So you've had to be really resilient. Well done. Now, this is just one of the activities you've done. And I can see your fabulous Viking ship, which looks very creative and required lots of perseverance. So well done, Sophie. And now to year two, an Endeavour class. And from Endeavour class, we have Arnav. Get down, get down, get down, get down. Now, Arnav. You've been using lots of sapphire power and we can see that you've remained really focused, focused on your learning. And also you've been using some emerald power. So you've had to stay focused and you've had to really, really dig deep into your learning. And we can see the different kind of learning that you have been doing. And Miss Giles is really impressed with you and you should be very proud of yourself. Well done. Now to our next class, and our next class is 
Apollo class. And in Apollo class, Mrs. Jammer has selected Sienna. Well done, Sienna. Now, Sienna, you have been using your sapphire and your emerald power and you've used them a lot with your inquiry and your fraction works this week. So that's great. You've had a great attitude and you're always keen to do a lot more. So well done. Fabulous. And now to our next class, which is... Wow, what's going on here? It's two classes and it's very unusual for us to get an award for two classes. But this one's for two children. One is in Sirius and one is in Endeavour. And that is, the two children are Felix from Sirius class and George from Endeavour class. Get down, get down. Miss Giles and Mrs Hennessy have been very impressed with George and Felix and also they've been hearing about our ex-pupil Elizabeth, who's their sister. They have been using their Topaz Together power. Now, if you remember, guys, that is when you're using all your gem powers at once, but you're using it, you're using them all together at the same time with other people. And we can see that you have created a great Jurassic Park there using the things you have at home, the toys that you have. I'm sure you've had to do lots of negotiating, deciding what was going where, who was doing what. And it sounds like a brilliant way to pass the afternoon by, being very creative with your Topaz power. Well done. Oh. I was hoping that wasn't going to happen, but it's now birthday time and for the birthdays, we're hoping to get them right this week. Let me pull up my list. So this week we have got Given from Sun Class, Uma from Mars, Shakai from Apollo, Abdurrahman from Endeavour, Vinny, Navea and Amber from Pegasus and Vinny from Sirius who has hit the double digits of 10. So happy birthday to all of you. Now it's time for us to have a sing. to have a fabulous birthday this week. Now, just to remind you, we look to the stars. Where do we look to the stars? Well, we can look to the stars wherever we are and in whatever we're doing. We don't just have to use our gem powers at school. We can use them all over the place and always try to be achieving the best that we can and being the best that we can be. So keep on looking at those shining stars. Now that's the end of my assembly. It's been great to talk to you. Hopefully I'm gonna see you again soon. Um, but if not, have a really safe and happy weekend. And don't forget, keep washing your hands. Bye.